Here with UWL head wrestling coach Dave Malachek after UWL's 29 13 win over UW Oshkosh Thursday night in Mitchell Hall. Coach, uh, your 29th straight win over oh. Oshkosh uh, didn't come easy, of no. course, uh, with, the, with the Titans. Uh, different lineup tonight. Let's just go right through right 125. Tristan yeah. came out right away and got that Tristan 10 in the Jenny, first minute. I mean, yeah, Dave, and you know what? We were changing our lineup as of noon today, and uh, we had injuries, we had sickness, we had a bunch of other things going on, and every guy we asked to step up and, and jump in there did. You know, Tristan Jennings starts out at 125 with a big pin. We put freshman Alex Kern in at 133, gets a good victory. Schlue at uh, Hayden Schlue at 141 pounds, battles back. I mean, he was beating that guy uh, in the contention for rankings, and Schlue and him have had some great battles over the year, wins it in the third period. Uh, 49, Danny Madonia, who was our 41 pounder, now has bumped up to 49, stepped in there, did a great job and battled hard at 149. Uh, 57, Logan Schlue, who was our 49 pounder, now was up at 57, got a big victory there, uh, showed how solid, it, how solid he is. And then 65 was the key matchup. I don't know if a lot of people knew that, but uh, the Oshkosh guys ranked second in the nation at 165. Zayman's ranked like sixth or seventh at 157. And when Zayman had the opportunity, the competitor he is, he goes, I'll move up, I want to wrestle that guy. And what a great matchup. Uh, you know, little things. When you wrestle a guy that good, you can't make those little mistakes. 74, Reed Williams jumps right in there. Uh, welcome to Reed back into town and, and in our lineup and has done a great job filling in for Sawyer Massey, who was hurt. Uh, and then 184, Adam Guskey gets beat, got in a, you know, a tough position. That guy's really good in, in, in the top position. We kind of stopped wrestling a little bit. And 97, I don't know if a lot of people knew too, but their guy was ranked fourth in the nation. And Cullen's right there with him the whole time uh, during that match. And then heavyweight, just a little slow start for Conrad. But once he got his confidence going, uh, comes out with a big win. So really pleased. I, I told you guys all along that every night in the conference is going to be a tough duel up and down the lineup. And so we found another one tonight. And, and uh, now coming up with Whitewater next Thursday, we got to be ready to go. Let's talk about what uh, tonight's match in terms of just the depth. And, yeah. and also how your guys just step you know, yeah. up awake fast or to move. Yeah. Just talk about your guys hey, overall. I, I tell you what, Dave, I just love this team and love these guys because there was no hesitation. And then as soon as we announced that one guy had to go, everybody started clapping for him like you can do this and they believe in each other and then all of a sudden we had another change at noon like hey you got to go today and they're like all right yeah we can do this and I show that shows a little depth but it shows the kind of teammates we have and very unselfish and I'm not gonna lie Dave this is probably the most nervous I've been for a duel in a long time just because we didn't know what to expect with our guys but Tristan Jenny really got us started and going. I just talk about where your team is right now you were seventh of the national duels yep. last weekend you go this weekend down to Invitational down in yep. Iowa. You got Whitewater here next Thursday night. But just yeah. talk about where you think you are with your team right well, now. I think we're progressing, and that's key, you know. And I think if we can get healthy as the season goes on, we got to try to have everybody ready to go by next Thursday. But big tournament tomorrow, some opportunities for or on Saturday uh, at the Matt Man Invite in Cornell College. But I think our team is in a good place. I think we got things to work on. I I know every one of those guys is thinking right now they got to get a little bit better. So I, I really think uh, we're going in the right direction. Thanks, Coach. You bet. Thanks, Dave.